Hey guys, I'm Jenna, also known as Ayala13. Today I'm going to show you how I painted the Animal Handler and Capybaras from Wreckage. Wreckage is a tabletop role-playing game set in the far distant dystopian future where the dregs of humanity are fighting it out over a wasteland. Uh, it reminds me very much of Fallout aesthetically. So my challenge for these models is going to be painting them a little bit dirtier than usual because my normal painting style is quite clean. I started with a white undercoat. The base was made using a runic textured roller from Green Stuff World. I began by base coating the base in scrag brown. Then I dry brushed the base with Zamisi Desert, followed by Screaming Skull. I painted the gun and other metal areas with cold steel. I washed the metal with Agrax Earthshade mixed with Nalna Oil. Then I stippled a little cold steel back on. At this point, I decided to go back and paint the stone hanging around her waist in the same manner as I painted the base. I base coated the hair with Doomball Brown, then highlighted it with Scrag Brown. I mixed this with a little Flash Gits Yellow for the final highlight. I painted her clothing and the feather in her hair with Arcane Blue. I highlighted by mixing a little white, followed by a wash with Meridius Blue. I painted the flesh with Midland Flesh and then washed it with Reichland Flesh Shade. I highlighted the flesh with Midland Flesh followed by Rin Flesh. I painted the eyes black and dotted in the whites with cream. I painted the lips with Doomball Brown highlighted with Midland Flesh. I glazed her eyelids with the same color. I painted her leather with Steel Legion Drab. The bedroll was painted with Ordic Olive with a wash of Athonian Camo Shade and then highlighted back with Ordic Olive. I painted the arm wrappings with Rakaf Flesh mixed with Bone. I painted the straps and bags with Blood Tracker Brown. I washed the leather, straps and bags with Agrax Earthshade. I also washed the metals again to try and make them look more tarnished. I picked out a few more metal details with Molten Bronze and washed them with Sepia. Now to paint the capybara. I started with the base coat of Mournfang Brown, followed by a wash with Agrax Earthshade. When that was done, I dry brushed the fur with Mournfang Brown. I shaded the nose and paws with Rhinox Hide and Black. The eyes were painted black, and the teeth with bone washed with Agrax Earthshade. I painted a white reflection dot in the eyes. I needed to make her look a little messier, she's still too neat for an apocalyptic wasteland. I made a wash from some secret weapon dry pigments and stippled haphazardly on the model and base. I finished the rim off with black and add some yellow static grass. And here are the finished models. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please like and subscribe. I'll see you later.